Hey you guys, it's Peter, and I'm back. Of course I'm back. I'm not going anywhere. Well, I just went to Miami, but I'm back from Miami. I'm not going anywhere, I'm YouTube famous now. And I'm even more YouTuber famous because Shane Dawson included me in a list of drama channels on his video where he did a three minute segment on conspiracy theories about drama channels on YouTube, which I talked about in my last video. But that's not really what this video is about. This video is really, really about Karina Kaboom and her video commentary on Shane Dawson's video. So. Sit back, get your drink of choice. Let's get into this. Let's figure out what we're gonna do. Let's get your good Judy by your side. Put up in the video in the car. Do what you gotta do. I don't care. But let's just get right into this. So let me just say before we get into this that hell has frozen over. Yes, boys and girls, hell has frozen over because this Peter Mon, I will admit on camera, I tell the truth, I will admit to the truth. I don't care if you don't like the truth. The truth is that Peter Mon agreed with every single thing that Karina Kaboom said in her video. I did. Um, if you guys know, what you don't know is a lot. I, I think not. Um, I have had a long history with Karina Kaboom. I don't think she's had as long of a history with me on YouTube because she just kind of like doesn't even acknowledge who I am. But I will say this. I've had a very long history with Karina Kaboom. She is really the very reason why I started doing drama videos to begin with. I didn't even know that they were called drama videos or drama channels. I mean, I really didn't. I didn't know a Karina Kaboom from a Judy Smith when I started this whole thing. I didn't. What, ha what had happened was, I know everybody loves that so much, but what had happened was, and I know I tell this a lot in videos, but if you're new here, you gotta get a little five second breakdown. I got consumed watching all the Jeffree Star versus Kat Von D videos. I watched a Sanders video about it, Sanders Kennedy. And then um, next to Sanders Kennedy was a video that Karina Kaboom did about Manny MUA, Manny Mua, as I refer to him, and um, how Manny like came for her or whatever. And then I watched her and I said, oh, she was very, very, very bitter about Manny Mua, who I thought was cute. And then I started talking about Manny Mua and how much I love Manny Mua and all this kind of stuff. So anyway, that's my history with Karina. I used to put blue nail polish in the background. Sometimes I still do. It's kind of a oh, boring joke at this point. But anyway, um, I have tended, I, I said in a couple videos ago that I don't really watch Karina anymore, which is the truth. And the only reason I don't watch Karina is not because I don't think that the girl is educated, because I do think that she puts out the drama very quickly. And I think she puts it out there like just her opinion, my opinion. And I think that she knows at this point, anything I say about, I, I hope she knows that anything I say about her is really just a joke. I'm not coming for her. I'm not bullying her. I think she actually has a very poignant voice in the drama community because she does it in a different way. She like gets it out there. She states her opinion and then nobody is allowed to comment on it because she has no comment section. But hey, you know what? At this point, her not having a comment section is part of her gig. Like I've said before, I wish she would open it up because I think that what she would find is that Karina has a lot of supporters out there. But anyway, so I watched this video and I'll tell you why I watched this video. It was because first of all, everybody wants to call me a drama channel. So she talked about the drama channels in there and I thought, well, I'll watch this video. That was number one reason. Number two reason times 10 reasons is that everybody and their brother contacted me and said, uh, Karina Kaboom is shading you in this video, so you need to go watch it. Well, listen, okay? I love a good Karina Kaboom shade, okay? Even though I don't understand what the hell's going on with those Scare Bears in the background. I mean, it's the world's biggest secret. I don't know who they are. I know they started out being Dustin Daly, but the dancing and all that kind of stuff, I don't get. Hey, girl, do your gig. Maybe just explain it a little bit, because if there's a joke, I don't, I like, I, hey, I'm, I like a good joke, you know? Like, why, you know, why, why like six afraid of seven? Because seven, Eight, nine. But anyway, I mean, I do. I like a good joke. So if there's something going on with the Care Bears, I want to know what the joke is. Just let me know. But anyway, so I was like, girl, did she really shade me? Did Karina really? I mean, I, did she, why is she coming for me? Okay? Like, listen, I'm just a nice old guy. There's no reason to come for me, Karina. 
I really do at this point think that Karina and I should like get under cahoots because everybody now is saying that we're like these old people dra drama channels. I mean, in the two, like I, we should be mom and dad of YouTube drama channels. Karina, I'm putting that out there for you. Contact me. You and I will be mom and dad of the drama community. I think it would be hilarious and I think everybody would love it because we're the most unlikely pair in the whole world. So anyway, I watch this video and I'm like sitting there watching it and I'm like, and she's very complimentary of Shane and therefore shouting out drama channels and all this kind of stuff. And I was like, yes, girl, yes, I agree with everything. Literally, I mean, I'm being 100% honest. Everything she said in there, I totally agreed with. And I do think, although a lot of people don't want to admit to it, I do think that drama channels are the next wave of YouTube community. I really do. I think whether people like it or not, it's the thing. And I thought, you know, like she said in there that she was really excited that Rich Lux, has been, there was a video clip of him and Shane's I was like, yes, ma'am. Rich got into a Shane video. I thought that was awesome. I was so excited for him. And I thought that what Rich said, I will link the Shane's video below if you haven't seen it. I mean, all the conspiracies in there from Justin Bieber being a reptile. Who'd care? People are really only interested in drama channels. Nobody cares about Justin Bieber anymore. Get on. But anyway, but uh, this clip that he shows of Rich is in there where he talks about the whole drama community and why the drama community is important is very profound. So go watch the video. It's important. I'm glad that he included the um, clip of Rich in there. And Rich is, you know, listen, Rich is growing and he did it on his own. Like his personality and his content is getting him there. So much props to Rich Lux. But anyway, so I was watching the video and so the, the I, if I'm right, if I'm right, okay, the drama channels that um, Shane puts in his video is me, Karina, Rich Lux, John Cookian. I can't remember who the, there's five. I can't remember who the fifth one is. And then he interviews here for the T and somebody else because he interviews drama channels that don't show their face, which we all know if you're in the drama community that here for the T shows her face. And then somebody commented underneath it. I think it was Queen Colleen. And then Shane said, uh, sis, I make 5 million videos a day. Get over <laughs> Oh my lord, my fans are flying. I mean, just to see Shane get right up in the drama of all of it, right? I, mean, I was like, girl, you don't know what you're starting by getting into all this. But I did love the little stream and people were sending me the tweets. I, listen, it's so fun. It's so fun. This whole YouTube gig is so fun. I love all of it. But I'm like waiting because at the beginning of the video, Karina says, this video is so good. So good. So good. I mean, she doesn't say it like that, but she says something like that. And I was like, oh, she's going to so fucking dog me. I know she's going to let this one have it, right? And I was ready. I was like, all right, girl, whatever. Listen, okay, she and I have this very slow tennis match. I throw a tennis ball. She throws it back to me about six weeks later. I throw it back to her. I mean, listen, it's been going on from the get-go, okay? And she was here a lot longer than me, so it's not like I re like reinvented the wheel, okay? She was doing the gig first. I give her credit for it. So anyway... So I watched it, and all of a sudden she starts talking about anti-drama channels, because that's what people told me, was that she calls me an anti-drama channel, she comes for that. In one video, I said that I was an anti-drama, anti, anti, Anna, Anna drama? I was an anti-drama channel, but I think everybody kind of knows that, like, I'm a little bit joking with that. Like, I am in that I poke fun at the drama channels, but I poke fun at anybody, so, like, everybody's fair game, so it's like, Call me what you want. I guess I am a drama channel. I mean, if Shane Dawson, if Shane, I mean, he can't be the king of YouTube because Shane called me the king of YouTube. So I guess he's like the prince of YouTube. I don't know. But anyway, if Shane Dawson calls you a drama channel, I, mean, I guess you're a drama channel, right? If Trisha Paytas calls you a drama channel, I guess you're a drama channel. If PewDiePie calls you a drama channel, well, I mean, that doesn't really matter. But anyway, so I was like, I guess I'm a drama channel. If I can just own it, Peter, do the drama. Do it. Do it. Start talking about the drama. People miss that anyway. Do your other videos in between. Do what you want. Do what you want. Have fun with it. Have fun with the YouTube gig. And I do. I have so much fun with it. But anyway, so I was watching this video and she was talking about this stuff in here. I was like, baby, she ain't talking about me. She ain't talking about this one. She wasn't. Not at all. I know she was talking about. She was talking about that Kendall Ray. And let me tell you one thing about, about Karina, okay? Karina, because this is how I knew it, right? So she talks about Shane responding to these drama channels and shouting them out. And she says several times in there, all of the relevant drama channels. And I'm like... She could have said all of the relevant drama channels except for one and shaded me. She didn't. She said 
all of the relevant drama channels. And I was like, okay, well that's fair. Like, I don't know if she's shading me because she thinks I don't consider myself a drama channel or if she's being a kindly person and a kindly, kindly. What outfits do you guys remember from Little House on the Prairie? Oh my God, one of my favorite episodes ever was when Nellie Olsen sees uh, Mary and uh, what was her name, uh, Half Pint. And she's like, what do you girls have on? And Laura goes, our Sunday best. And Nellie goes, country girls. I love that so much. <laughs> That's what I'm going to say to Karina when I see her. <laughs> country girl. No, she's not. But anyway, um, she's talking about relevant drama channels. And I was like, she's not dogging me. She's actually giving me a compliment. Kind of. Unless she's saying Peter doesn't really want to be a drama channel. But I think, don't people get my gig by now like I laugh at myself more than I laugh at anybody else life is fun life is short laugh at yourself before you're gone like hello that's my message to the world so anyway and I just love all of it I don't really care if I'm doing drama I don't really care what it is I don't care where I you know am situated but I did thought I did think it was very cool that she included me in there and said the relevant drama channel so Karina if you're watching this video which she says she doesn't watch my videos but if she is thank you and if you'd like to be the mom and pop of the drama channels please reach out to me I won't shade you I won't come for you I promise you here you have it on video I would love to work with you can you guys would I mean, the world would die if you saw a video and Karina and I came out together. We're like this, fanning away with Care Bears and blue nail polish all around us. The world would come to an end in the drama community. They would be like, I would love it so much, trust, I would. By the way, Amy Slayton's doing my makeup for uh, Jeffree Star and Manny MUA's pa uh, it's not a palette, their lip liner. Since everybody was so upset that I called it a lip uh, lipstick, their lip liner and their highlighter. So Amy Slayton I contacted and Amy Slayton said that she was more than willing to do my makeup for that video. So I can't wait for that iconic collab, iconic collab, iconic, iconic, iconic collab. So anyway, can you imagine me and Karina kaboom doing a video together? I would die. So anyway, and she, everybody thinks I'm going to shade people on camera. I'm not. It's like Amberlynn Reed won't come into my you now stream because she thinks I'm going to shade her. Girl, I'm not going to shade you. I'm going to be completely nice about the whole thing. So anyway, and I wouldn't do that to Karina either. I wouldn't put somebody on the spot and be cruel to them. I'm just like, that's not who I am as a person. So she goes in. Oh my God, I, my fan is breaking. Broken fans. <laughs> so anyway, um, so I'm watching this video where she starts talking about anti-drama channels this and anti-drama channels that and they're just pissy because drama channels are making more money than some drama channels and maybe they're not maybe they are go watch her video listen I'll tell you one thing I do love about Karina Kaboom she always links the videos underneath her she gives credit where credit's due and hey props to you baby and I'm gonna do that with her video I'm gonna put her video below and everybody go watch it because I think she has a lot of really great things to say in the video did that just come out of my mouth? No, I'm joking. No, she does. She has some really profound things to say about drama channels, the future drama channels, and also these channels that are coming for us. And now what's really funny is a lot of other people are trying to get relevant on the backs of drama channels. What? Ow! It hurts. Get off my back. Quit using us. Karina and I aren't getting any younger, folks. It hurts. Stop, ow, stop stepping on my shoulders to get to the top. I'm sorry that your channel's failing. I didn't say that Karina did, by the way. You know who you are. So anyway, I love that she low grade shaded her and she doesn't even, and the one thing that she, Karina will do, okay, if you watch her videos enough is, if she's shading you or if she's calling you out, she'll never say your name in a video. So she's like, I'm sure that, I'm sure that you know who is probably watching and going, who is this video about me? What? Oh, uh, conspiracies. <laughs> oh, girl. Karina, you got in good. I loved it. I was sitting there. And I watched it at the airport. Airport. I watched it at the airport yesterday. I was literally laughing to myself. My husband, Alex, is like, what are you laughing at? I was like, Karina got in good. He was like, Karina Kaboom. Of all the YouTubers in the world, Shane Dawson, Trisha Paytas, and then Karina Kaboom, those are probably the three names that Alex actually does know, my husband. Oh, and Gigi Gorgeous, because he loves her. But anyway, I was like laughing my ass off watching that video. It was good. When she said at the beginning of it, this is going to be a great video, I was like, yes. And so thank you, Shane, for shouting us all out, all of the relevant drama channels. Now, she, will say, she does say in her video that Shane watches all of us and Shane knows about all of us. Well, I have to say, 
as a little bit of an insider tip that I, because I do know, Trisha, I know that Shane does not watch us. And I do know that Shane's not consumed with us. And I do know for a fact that Shane didn't even really know some of our names. And that's just the fact of the matter. And that's okay. Shane is like 10 times more busy than having to worry about drama channels. And we don't really ever do any videos about him anyway. In fact, I'm really the only one that talks about him because I think he's so cute. I do. And because he's next, my next husband, if he ever breaks up with Ryland, <laughs> And my husband and I get divorced, and he wants a boyfriend that has a fan that's much older than him. I mean, what? I mean, I've talked about him in so many videos, people are probably like, you dropped Shane Dawson's name again. Yes, but it's been months, so get over it, okay? He's a fucking hottie. I love him. So anyway, but, um, and I love that he's so funny and so intellectual and that he called us out. I mean, why wouldn't you, right? But anyway, no, he doesn't really watch our videos on a regular basis, <laughs> I hate to say. But that was the only thing she got wrong. Other than that, I thought she was 100% right about all of it. And, um, I mean, seriously, when your fans are gone, the world's falling apart. <laughs> Look shade to somebody else out there. So anyway, what do you guys think? Did you watch Karina's video? Did you watch Shane's video? If you haven't, I'm going to link it below. Go watch them and then let me know what you think about the drama channels. What do you think is the future of the drama channels? I mean, do you think we're the next big thing? I guess I am a drama channel. I am a drama channel. I love you guys so much. I'll talk to you later. Bye.